from this particular decision, there are issues in which the law too often feels as if it is being applied in a discriminatory fashion. I don't think that's the norm. I don't think that's true for the majority of communities or the vast majority of law enforcement officials, but these are real issues. And we have to lift them up and not deny them or try to tamp them down. What we need to do is to understand them and figure out how do we make more progress. And that can be done. That won't be done by throwing bottles. That won't be done by smashing car windows. That won't be done by using this as an excuse uh, to vandalize property. And it certainly won't be done by hurting anybody. Uh, so uh, to those in Ferguson, uh, there are ways of channeling your concerns constructively, and there are ways of channeling your concerns destructively. Michael Brown's parents understand what it means to be constructive. Uh, the vast majority of peaceful protesters, they understand it as well. Um, those of you who are watching tonight uh, understand that uh, there's never an excuse for violence particularly when there are a lot of people in goodwill out there who are willing to work on these issues.